So today we're gonna change out the radiator in my 1985 Z28 Camaro. It has been leaking and the cores are clogged up. If you look kind of right back in there, they're a little corroded from lime in the water. So we're gonna change it up. First thing you want to do is block up the rear tire so the car can't move. Try to shoot these bricks. One in front, one behind. Then you want to jack up the car, find your jack point, you want to jack it up. I put it on these blocks so it can't fall on me at all. couple top pieces off and then I'll drain it and get started from there. This is for the overflow tank. Ah, so this is going to come off so I'm just going to cut it off because I got plenty of line. Takes care of that. Heater hose off. There we go. Try to set it up to where it won't hopefully leak any fluid out. Alright, let's drain it. Alright, right there's the drain plug. It's up underneath at the bottom of the radiator. I'm gonna take it loose and drain the fluid. The antifreeze. Is it completely freaking out? Oh, nope, there it is. Oh, gosh. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Majority of it. All right, now we'll get these hose clamps broke loose for the radiator hose. There we go. Okay. Next up will be the transmission cooler lines. All right, so my hard line is just wanting to twist in here. So I'm just gonna cut it off and just put a hose clamp in it. It's not a, it's not a high pressure line, so it's nothing crazy. Sometimes you just get stuck and you can't get them out. Should just throw it out. Yep. So see there it's starting to twist. So, so so the bottom one's already been cut, so I'm just gonna take it loose and just pry it off of there. There's two 13 millimeter bolts at the top. There should be two at the bottom, but mine was just zip my fan was just zip tied on. Oh. Actually that factory might be 10 millimeter bolts. These are not factory bolts. This top piece is held on with these four 10 millimeter bolts. That just lifts 
Ja. Ready to be ready to lift out. I just gotta get the line down there off. There we go. It is out. I got this radiator out of our 82 Camaro parts car. And we tested it, it didn't leak. So let's put it in. He's put on as well. clamp back on my bottom cooler line I'm gonna go underneath and tighten it up in this its place right, getting the bottom hose put on make sure you can't turn it nope okay all right so I got both of the transmission lines hooked back up, I had to cut them loose because they were just froze in the end of the flare nut there. So now I'm gonna put the heater hose back on. There we go. That's tight. Now I'll get the overflow tank hose back on. The upper radiator hose put back on. Go. Okay, make sure the drain plug's tight. Looks like it. This is the radiator the new radiator in the car. You can see it's not all corroded up. And it should keep the car cooler. Thanks for watching and be sure to like and subscribe and go follow us on TikTok at GM underscore junkie for more car content.